In this video, we are going to see how to attach a file to an email on Gmail. There are several ways to do it, but in this video, we will cover the direct attachment method and the Google Drive attachment method. Both methods work if you are composing a new email or if you're responding to an email. Let's start with the direct attachment method. For this method, you have to have the file downloaded on your computer. For this example, we will use a PDF file that is located in our downloads folder. Start composing a new email. Add contacts, subject, and message. Now click on the attach files icon. This new window will open. Navigate to the folder where the file is and select the file. Now click on open. Here you can see that the file has been attached. You can attach more files if you need to. The file size limit for a direct attachment is 25 megabytes. Finally, to send the email, click on send. Another way to direct attach a file is by dragging and dropping it from a folder on your computer. Let's respond to this email. Then open the folder where the file is. Once you find the file, drag and drop it into the email you were composing. The second method we will review is attaching a file from Google Drive. To do it, first you have to have the file in your Google Drive. If you don't know how to upload a file to Google Drive, please watch the video, Google Drive Overview Under 3 Minutes. Compose a new email and add contacts, subject, and message. Now click on the button, Insert Files Using Drive. This new window will open. Here you can search for the file you would like to attach. Please note that there is a submenu here that can help you find the file easier. For example, if you recently uploaded the file to Google Drive, you can click on the Recent tab. You can also navigate between folders until you find the file. If you know the name of the file, you can just search for it using the search bar. Type the name of the file and press Enter. Once you have located the file you want to attach, click on it to select it, and then click on Insert. As you can see, the file has been inserted into this email. To send it, click on the Send button. Depending on the file you are sharing, you will get some notifications asking to give access to the file you are sending. Check that everything looks good and finally click on send.